All right, everyone, this is John McCall, and yes, we are at the lake. Uh, let's hope there isn't some crazy bikers trying to uh, jump scare me. So today, I want to do a shout out to uh, Dan Aicheshu. I really hope I pronounced the name right. Um, but basically, Dan is my favorite fish keeper um, of all YouTube. And it's been pretty much six months that I uh, follow uh, all of his videos. I mean, there isn't a video that he posts that I didn't see for the past six months or so. Um, Dan is just an amazing YouTuber. I mean, he don't overcomplicate itself himself. He's he's probably just there on YouTube to share all of his info and sometimes ask some questions uh, for all of us. But really, um, he is amazing. Uh, he has 14 tank on his, in his uh, basement, a really nice fish room, full of amazing fish. He has like um, a native aquarium, a 125 native uh, North American aquarium, just amazing, uh, full of crazy stuff in there. Uh, there is uh, a 125 African team tank, um, there is like angel fish. Uh, he have gi giant gourami, uh, at least he still have one. He have tiger barbs, he have a black ghost knife fish, he have Congo tetras, he have so many fish, so many fish, but yet uh, each and every single one of his aquarium are really beautiful and uh, I just, I just love it. Um, I just love uh, all of his videos because he don't overcomplicate itself. In, uh, itself he he do realistic things uh, I mean right now I know I cannot have like 14 tanks but I know that in the future in like 10 or 20 years um, I'm gonna be able to do what he do uh, or, and pretty much every single one of us could and he really is a good uh, source of inspiration this is really what I'm trying to get at uh, I mean he do stuff with uh, he, he don't overcomplicate itself. Uh, I mean, he do uh, many things that uh, every, um, not beginner, but every uh, novice uh, fish keeper could do. Uh, maybe in a smaller scale, but I mean, contrary to the king of DIY, which do amazing projects, yes, but I, I will never be able to have a 2,000 gallon aquarium. Uh, what Dan Aichesu do, uh, I know that one day I could do it and one day I want to do it um, the way he does. Um, and he is really uh, a great guy, he is amazing. And sadly, um, a few days ago he lost like 600 uh, YouTubers. He was almost at uh, 10,000 uh, subscribers and then boom, in a fraction of a second he lose 600 uh, uh, subscribers and I really think that uh, every single one of us should really subscribe to him well I I know personally I did uh, a long time ago but he is amazing and really he has so many great uh, fish and so many great information that leaf on my face um, but really Danai Cheshu is really a great guy uh, I mean he doesn't live stream, he doesn't uh, do shout out, he doesn't do any of that. He he is just there to show us uh, his fish and he do it really well. I mean, he is a simple man with a, an amazing uh, set of aquarium with um, really a great pass of uh, fish keeping. He have like he only started uh, 4 years ago and yet he he have kept so many fish and the thing I really like about uh, Dan is that he just tries stuff. It, um, he's not afraid to show us his mistakes. Uh, right now he is having uh, some difficult time. He, he is losing quite a lot of fish. But I know uh, at the end of the line he is taking care of his aquariums. And really he's probably the only YouTuber that I watch every single one of his videos. I mean all of his tank. I'm never going to, well, never say never, never uh, obviously, but I'm not really interested 
in uh, pea puffers or anything like that but he have some and they are amazing I mean I look at uh, those and I'm like wow they are really cool maybe I'm not interested necessarily in all of the, the fish he have but he just make them interesting and there is only a few uh, fish, keeping, fish keeper uh, youtubers that are able to do that to really interest me in fish that I'm not even interested uh, in the first place I mean no hate on um, on um, rainbow fish uh, but I don't think they are interesting but in his tank he have five of them with Congo tetras and no hate on Congo tetras I'm not I'm just not interested really in Congo tetras but the mix of them is just so beautiful I mean he's able to just show show us things that are amazing and yet simple so everyone if you don't know Dan eye tissue please uh, subscribe to him or at least look at a few of his videos and I can assure you you will not uh, regret this so anyway thanks for watching and we'll see you real soon ciao